And almost a year into the pandemic, some Iowans are still reluctant to visit the dentist. The Iowa Dental Association says the number is as high as 20 percent. Tonight, we look at what that could mean for you as we move into 2021. At least when it comes to like the dentist and stuff, I, I have a lot of stress, so I grind my teeth, I have a mouth guard. So Chris Rankin never gave a second thought to visiting her dentist, even during the pandemic. If you're not maintaining and doing things regularly, that you could really run the risk of, you know, missing something or jeopardizing something. But for some, that risk isn't enough to bring them back. Dr. Zach Corey says 20% of patients are delaying routine visits and treatment. I mean, going to the dental office is trying to not only prevent things, but also catch things when they're small so they don't become bigger things. So um, some people are working on a little bit over a year that, that, that we have not seen them. So what does that mean for later on this year as people become maybe a little bit more comfortable or problems may become more urgent? Is it going to be tough for you to get in to see your dentist? We might get busier, but I don't think we're going to get busy enough to be able to not be able to handle the patient load, uh, most likely. Dr. Corey, who worked early on to establish pandemic protocols for dentists statewide, said from a COVID-19 perspective, your dentist office may be one of the safest places to go. There have not been any COVID-related outbreaks in any dental office in the whole United States. So we're doing unbelievably well at, at keeping people safe. Which is why Rankin feels comfortable getting those checkups in. They had like a letter of like, here's the lowdown. Here's how we're doing stuff. You know, let's make sure we follow these. And I was like, awesome. A poll conducted by the American Dental Association shows only a quarter of Iowa dentists say they're seeing as many patients as before the pandemic.